What's going on guys? Just ordered this gas cover for my 2018 Jeep Wrangler JL. If you haven't noticed, JL and JK is two different models. I actually ordered a Jeep brand from Amazon and they gave me a JK gas cover instead and it was the diameter was a lot smaller than the JL. So if you guys do order a gas cover, make sure you guys get the JL or JK, whatever model you have. But yeah, came with two sets of keys. So it came with installation instructions. Pretty much a pick the ground on how to do this procedure. So you will need a T40 bit. And I have a, all you need is a flathead and something to put the bit in so you can twist it in for the brake light to remove it. First of all, you want to take out this covering. I use a flathead, but uh, a lot of people use uh actual cover remover that's pretty simple you see the gap you just press it in pop it up and no it didn't scratch it and then once you open it the screw for the bit will be in there this is about six inches long so just counterclockwise twist it righty tighty lefty loosey baby but yeah keep twisting it until it comes out it's a plastic screw and it has the screw has a spring in it so you'll see later like when you tighten it you don't want to over tighten it because you, you could possibly break that plastic so keeps unscrewing but there it is there's a spring I was talking about and once you got that removed go back to the tail light Pop it open. It comes out really easy. So the only thing holding it is these wires, the brake light wires. So first thing you want to do is push that red clip back. Then you want to push on this black thing between the both reds down. Yeah, so it's kind of hard to record and work on the car or truck at the same time, but yeah. So all you do is press that black piece in between the reds. So it's easy. It just gets it out of the way and so you have more room to work on the gas cover. Next step, un unattach the trap for the gas cap. It's easy, you just pull it out, then I'll just take the gas cap off. And there she is. Easy. Now you wanna do is there's these latches. There's four latches. Like the brake light latch, you just wanna press press it to remove it. So it's pretty easy. Just stick your hand in there and press it. There's Two on this side, and then two on the other side. There's four total. So I press it with my right hand, and I pull the gas cover with my left, so it'll be easier. But as you can see, it's still kind of hard to record it. <laughs> I just changed it to one hand man, or one hand handyman. There you go. But yeah, pops out. Oh yeah, so it comes out easy. And then the whole thing holding it is a little rubber gasket that goes around the gas tube. So, so it's pretty easy. You just pull it out. It's not hard. A lot of people said it was hard to pull out, but mine came out really easy, as you can see. So, eh. Mucho bueno. Very good. So there's the four latches I was talking about. How you just press it in. You just press it in. It's easy. It's like a spring latch or something. I have no idea what they call it. They have new words every day. But yeah. So I put the gasket inside of it. And there's four clips to go back in there. So make sure 
you match that in. If not, you might scrape your paint because you know. But yeah. So this part, I slowly go around the the rubber piece to get it inside the gasket. But yeah, just make sure it's flush. It's in there. Make sure the latches are in there. Nice and tight. You can see it's in there. And you could test it and you could pull it. But bitch ain't coming out, you know? And reverse process. The gas cap latch back on. Put that gas cover back on. Or knob. Twist it. Twist it. There you go. Close it. It looks like a new Jeep. Oh yeah. But yeah, you want to do this pretty much reverse the way you took it out. It's the same way you put it back in. So. Yep. So you want to put the plug back in. But when you make sure you put the plug back in, you want to snap it and then push the red clip all the way forward. Push it, push it in to secure it and to lock it. And these prongs will go back in the hole, so it's easy. You just line it up. At first, I thought this whole installation would be hard. But it's pretty easy. I got done in like under 10 minutes. I would have done got done under 10 minutes if I didn't have to record this. But pretty simple. I just hand tighten it first. Then I get the bit, the T40 bit, and just tighten it. But like I said, you don't want to over tighten it because that screw breaks. You are effed. But yeah, tighten it. Clockwise. So. Keep turning and turning. Keep turning. Oh. Dropped it. Okay. Keep turning. Keep turning. Turn. You guys are wondering where I got this drill bit handle holder thingy. Got it at Walmart. It was like a whole drill bit case. But yeah, you want to make sure the tail light's flush and it is flushed. So I want to like little tighten it a little more. Put the cover back on. The struggle is real. Just kidding. It's not hard. It's just snap back in. You don't want to overdo it. But yeah. There she is. And there's a new gas cover. So it's pretty simple, guys. So it's locked. Got my key out. It's pretty quality. Like I said, the quality is really good for an Amazon product. So, and I feel safer. I could like go long drives and not worry about someone stealing my gas or putting, putting something in there or even.